Tennessee is just one of several states dealing with a widespread flu outbreak. Right now, about half the states in the country are reporting flu activity. Fox reporter Elizabeth Cohen tonight to show us why the flu shot should be on the short list of things you need to do right now. <coughs> In just one week, the number of states reporting widespread flu has more than doubled from 10 states to 25. Among the victims of the flu so far this season, 25-year-old Ann Phillips Dwan from South Bend, Indiana, who passed away on Christmas Eve, and 5-year-old Ronan Burgess, who died in Portland, Oregon. We're seeing a lot of illness in young adults who may lack immunity. Young people die from the flu every year, but this year it could turn out to be particularly bad because the main flu strain out there is H1N1, what used to be called swine flu, and it disproportionately affects people under 65. But there is good news. So far, the main strain we're seeing is H1N1. Unfortunately, that strain is well covered by every one of the flu vaccines out there. That's right, H1N1 is in the flu shot, and it's not too late to get one. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention recommends the flu vaccine for nearly everyone. It does take two weeks for the shot to build up immunity, so in the meantime, it's especially important to remember to wash your hands. Elizabeth Cohen, CNN, reporting.